here we are at my hotel, and this is my reservation. So today we're going to be talking about Steve-O from Jackass. Now, we love Steve-O. I mean, before any of this happened, we were huge fans of his back in high school. We've all seen a Jackass video or two. It was absolutely hilarious, but I'm telling you what, if, if we liked him then, we definitely like him more now because he recently just got sentenced to 30 days in jail for his uh, demonstration against SeaWorld. Now this is ridiculous, and the city also thought this was ridiculous, and he only served nine hours, so don't worry guys. And then they let him go. Dude, how was that, dude? Dude, I, I didn't even get a chance to sleep, dude. I so Steve-O has been a vegan for many years, and he is actually a huge vegan activist. I'm Steve-O, and I just want everybody to know that I'm 100% vegan. You know, if it's got anything to do with the vegan lifestyle, I'm all over it. Being eating meat was so positive. It really benefited me so much that I was just like, man, I can do more, you know? He's been, he may have pushed it a little too far. He was caught climbing up a crane with fireworks and a shamu whale. There's kind of no stopping me now. now although, it, although it may seem kind of harmless, it generated huge attention. I mean, there were helicopters. Fire trucks, police officers everywhere. We got lots of fire trucks, tons of cops, and we got shammy. I mean, yeah, I can't really hate on him too much for stirring up that much controversy and not hurting anyone, so I think he's doing a good job. The helicopter's not that close, right? Woo! I just hurt myself. <laughs> Absolutely, I can definitely say that his, uh, he really wanted to get a lot of attention, and he and he did exactly that. It was just kind of ridiculous because uh, they will claim that they, that uh, they didn't know if Steve was a jumper or not. But I mean, with a little bit of under un, undercover, they could have went to his Facebook page or his YouTube page because he said he he um, was gonna do all of this. So it kind of seems kind of needless and kind of kind of blowing it way bigger than it needs to be. Like getting like. 30, 40 people? I mean, you're just wasting everyone's time at this point. <laughs> but, 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 oh, once again, I'm gonna have to give Steve a big props because he wanted to generate a lot of attention. And I'm putting my foot down for Shamu. If doing that was wrong, I don't wanna be right. Screw you, SeaWorld. And the reason why Steve-O is doing all of this is because he understands that the meat industry is absolutely brutal on every single level for health, for the environmental, and most of all, for the animals. Food which is, ah, uh, made with cruelty mm -hmm. is generally unhealthy. I mean, I kind of feel the same thing as Steve-O. You just want to, you know, once you realize what's actually happening, you just want to stop it and you want to do anything in, in your power and sometimes climbing a crane with a, some fireworks in a, sea, in a sea wheel seems like a good idea. Absolutely, because it is a common myth that we need our protein, that killing animals is is a uh, okay that you know it's okay for the for the environment and it's completely sustainable and that is absolutely false so we really want to give a lot of credit to steve-o and everybody out there that's trying to spread the vegan message everybody with a huge following and we urge urge lots of people with even bigger followings yeah. to really get this message out, out there all of you activists out there, I see everyone's new YouTube channels are doing certain things to try and get people and just good job on, on everybody doing your part just trying to get the vegan message out. Absolutely. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel because we are uploading tons of vegan videos all the time just trying to spread the truth and spread the message. Just trying to tell everybody that it's fruits and vegetables for life and it's fruits and vegetables for the win.